Starting route to Long Beach Antique Market. We have made it in. This is what I need for your side table. Who wants to smash things or run fast? I want to be able to fly. I want to be able to negotiate. Mom wants a man, a windblown man. I'm still shocked by this whole rug news. Or have my mom paint me one. <laughs> Welcome back to the vlog. It's very early because we're not doing well today. We're dropping everything. It is early because it's not even daylight yet. So that's how you know it's early. Gray glow. Outside. The gray glow. We are on our way to the flea market. We are serious today. We are not joking around. I missed the Rose Bowl pretty much completely because I was editing. So. I was so sad. That made me so sad. No, I was so sad. You're going to be a good girl, Kent. I know it's early. Oh. You're gonna go back to sleep. Okay, let's go. I love you, kids. Cannot forget my coffee. Cannot forget our wagon either. Oh, it's getting somewhat daylight now. Yeah, just daylight. Yeah. Starting route to Long Beach Antique Market. We have arrived. It's about 40 something minutes. 40 minutes, I think. First time we're using our wagon. It's wrinkled. She looks all wrinkled like a piece of no. She hasn't been filmed yet. We should take a walk down the street. We have made it in. That's very, that's very pretty. Five dollars. Oh, I'm in deep trouble. Super mom. <laughs> they were waiting for me. Hi. <laughs> they were. They were waiting for you. I've seen a lot of this stuff lately. You put a candle in it and it glows. They have a shop on, um, what is it? In what? Fredericksburg. It's oh, some really? type of rock. And then, oh. I think. I don't know. We'll have to ask our friends. That'd be pretty in a, like a bathroom. Like a oh, glows. Like it glows? This is what I need for your side table. 20 bucks for that. $20? Yeah. Is it, is it too short? It might be too short. Yeah, but it won't be forever. <laughs> it won't be forever because I'm going to move my bed up there. If you sanded it, it would be very pretty. Oh, sick. for sure. Yeah. For sure. That's probably what I'd do. Okay, Especially the top. Thank you. And everything, yeah. Look at that big tapestry. <laughs> yeah, he has some good stuff sometimes. They always have like plant, pretty plant booths. This time of year, though, that would be yeah. nice. It's a tapestry. Oh. It's pretty. Wow. It's 180, 185. It's like all stripped. It's pretty. Ready to go. Yeah. Mona. Yeah. Mona Lisa. Pretty picture. These are so cute. <laughs> this one's so pretty, but it's so expensive. A seven ninety five. Here's the here's the auction paper if you'd like to read it. The colors are so pretty. They're really cool. They're pretty Definitely need to cut a top. I don't know Yeah, no. 60. <laughs> That's, I went up for, I was gonna say 50. Everything is ships. And the frames are really <laughs> The mirror. Okay, it is officially started to drizzle. Um, but I'm getting great deals now that mom's here. Great deals. Mom gives me, well, yeah. Well, mom not only negotiates for me, she also gives me the power to do it myself. Like, I'm like, oh. It's a superpower. It's a, oh, is it, is it your superpower? If you had any superpower, would that be what it would be? Negotiation? Yeah. <laughs> That's what I would want it to be. Who wants to smash things or run fast? I want to be able to fly. I want to be able to negotiate. Oh, I want to fly. <laughs> you want to fly? Yeah. I flew over here. It ain't I'll fun. Fl I'll fly you. No, I don't want to fly with other people. <laughs> I'll fly you and then you negotiate and we can take over the world one state sale at a time. $65. 
So we just went to a rug booth and one was hanging and I really liked it, but it was really distressed. And he said what they're doing now is they're taking not so old rugs and acid washing them and it washes out the color and it makes them look like vintage Persian and vintage Turkish rugs, but they're not. And they're cheaper, which is great for budget friendly, but that's something good to know because if you, they, I feel like they can, don't you feel like they could easily like hoodwink you? <laughs> like say that they're vintage and they're not. That one was around 700 and the Persian ones can run, you know, several thousand. So they're with the true vintage. It's pretty, 24. I think I saw some here like this before, like a couple of them. So, you like that? I don't know. <laughs> Seems like I've seen those. Yeah. I'm not kidding. I'm still shocked by this whole rug news. I, I don't know, know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Like, I, I get well, that it's you have to more be budget honest. friendly. You have to be but he, he was very honest about it. We're going to look it up. We're going to research it. I didn't know you could do that. I don't know if I like it or not. Like, I like that it is more budget friendly, for sure. But, I don't know. I'm, I'm curious about mine now, or like my, mine are real for sure, but still. Veg, vegetable parfums? Explosion Universal. Oh, but that's so beautiful. It's 100 bucks. How many do you want? Oh, no, no, I don't want it. It is pretty. But though. it's so pretty. It is pretty. Love it. That's, I see a bunch of big old gladiolas. Yeah. Oh, gladiolas. Oh. oh. It's pretty, but it's got corners are kind of messed up it's kind of falling apart you know See, like as weird. yeah look how precious these ceramic homes are how much are they oh, so the, the first mom wants a man a wind-blown man huh you need a man <laughs> he made sounds she wants to know how much her man is. Is he heavy? He's hollow. Oh, he's hollow. I see. I can't believe I took mom to the Long Beach flea market for the first time and it's raining. It's it's sprinkling harder now. <laughs> That's a bunny. I need little, little art. Like teeny tiny. Like think teeny, 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 tiny. You want teeny, tiny? I want teeny, tiny art. I'm talking like... Three by five. The whole thing. The Three frame and everything. Oh. Yeah. She said I could buy Kinsley some friends. Oh, they are. They're solid. No. It's a little bit too. No. Yeah. Ah! Oh, I it. it could work. It's so cute. This is so pretty. Solid. But that's so cool. Just like a unique little thing to put on a shelf. These are so cool though. Like it's I don't know what they understand. Like are they pages from books or they're so cool. Oh. You know to frame. Mm -hmm. I wasn't gonna take it. Like the fruits. Oh those are pretty. I like color though. Yeah. Robert uses like tannicus. I'm like hyper focused on finding a little art now. I want a little art. Because I think I've determined that I have a lot of medium sized pieces. I either need big or I need small. And right now, I'm, I, we got a few big ones. I need some smalls. Okay. Teeny tiny. Think tiny. Think teeny tiny. Just, yeah, just a tree of that. Cut it? Yeah, no. It's really cool. This one's pretty though. Yeah. It's grand the shade would ruin it yeah mama gets the win she found me a little one i mean i'm kind of like desperate at this point but this one's cute that's cute, it's super cute. yeah but I, i'll change i'll print one of yours for it because i don't know if i like the girl but i'll print maybe turn it sideways put a little landscape in it one of mom's now i'm just kind of looking for things that i can turn into art and then i'm like oh my god what was i thinking it's raining. It's raining. Look at this. <gasps> Whoa, we're waiting for it to stop because it's very like on off, on off, on off. It's not like raining consistently, so it should be okay. Girl, I 
think it's time I let you go Writing songs about you is getting old Can't see your face anymore Oh, the love I once adored Oh, there's someone who'll make you happy instead. I love this little book. But the love we fight for. No. It's tucked away. Oh, yeah. $20? That's a nice book. It's yeah. not rain. It's. It's not full on like drizzle. It's yeah, drizzling. it's it's and right. it's a harder drizzle now than it was earlier. And I had to carry that big piece of art through it. Back so, to all my stuff I didn't buy the first time. I didn't bought that bunny. Mom has a tendency bunny. to be like, I'll be back. I'll be back. And then she wants it still. And then we have to backtrack. I don't I can't shop like that. Because I won't go back and get it and then I'll I'll be sad. But see what I can't remember, I won't say I should have got that. Because yeah. I don't remember it now. Oh, okay. Well, and that's I've, good. So, what's your thoughts on the Long Beach Flea? I love it. That's pretty. pretty. That's pretty. Do you like it more or less than the Rose Bowl? Uh, minus the rain. Not well, yeah. <laughs> don't take into account the rain. Let's, I like this one better. Yeah. For this sure. one's better than the for Rose sure. Bowl. Well, I think so. It's, it's more, not better, just better use of time. Yeah. Like sure it it's a smaller. Oh wow, mom's looking at art. She got an art book. So we got here at like a little before eight mm -hmm. and it's 1.45. We closed it down. We well, we didn't well, open it, but close to. Good morning, guys. Uh, we had a fun day at the flea market even though it rained. It did rain. It, it sprinkled all day. <gasps> On and off. We got some day. good deals though. Yeah, we got some good deals because it was raining and a lot of people were leaving. It was just an overall, I can imagine how hard it is to have a good sales day of those people in, in the rain, you know? So we got some good art pieces. I really wanted some teeny tiny art. So we'll do a haul when we get back. Um, but mom and I are gonna go eat some lunch. I have this place that I wanna take her to. And then I have two places that have been on my list to go to that I just like want a friend to go with. Like Romeo would totally go with me. Um, to like, you know, home decor stores. And I know that this has been a shopping vlog, but that's what we love to do. Even if we don't find anything to have or spend any money, it's just fun. It's fun to go to flea markets. It's fun to just go shopping. And it's kind of like our bonding time. Mom and I have always like, just like to go and do anything together really, but movies or whatever, but shopping is fun. I just want to see like what's out here and um, look at the, like the newer stores, even though I could never decorate a whole house with all new stuff. I realized that I need the the second hand or the mix or the vintage or the old. It's just part of our style, you know? So we're gonna go eat and go to those two places. One is a little bit of a drive, but not far. Um, it's like a little antique mall that I saw one day that I wanna go to, so. And then we'll do a haul when we get back. What are you complaining about? I got it. <laughs> it was a pilot she, error oh, pilot error. But you're the passenger. Co pilot error. Co pilot error, yeah. Mom liked the lunch. You like the lunch? I love it's it. It's a super cute little cafe. It is cute. Okay, now we are at an antique mall that I've been wanting to go to. I've never, we're going to experience this for the first time together because okay. I've never been here. So I'm going to take you guys on my phone. Uh, we went to the other home store, but it was like a consulting design firm. We couldn't get in, there was no one in there. It looked cute though. We didn't have an appointment though. I want an appointment. I just want to look. I know. <laughs> Lots of jewelry. Flower frog. Oh, you can put the stems in it? Maybe they have some tiny baby art for me. Oh. I'm finding a lot of art like laying down. Like, I gotta look at it. Oh. <laughs> comic. Oh, a uh, they're just like not hitting the mark. Like, yeah. Yeah, I love that. Yeah, I don't love the oak. Ooh. I don't know. Books. Okay, 
we made it back. I definitely wanted to find some smaller little art frames, but I did find a few that I can turn into art, I think, uh, from the from the flea market. That's the art that I have left here, but it's all, what I realized it's all the same size. Essentially, it goes on the similar size walls, you know? Um, so it's all like a, a quote unquote, a medium. I need smaller than that and bigger than that. So I got some of that and some other things that I found. Mom's found some great frames for her art and stuff. This was actually, I was just about to put you on this, but this, I need to show you this. I got it for 20 bucks. It's a little pedestal table. It's a little short for a side table, although that might be what I try and use it for for now, but I feel like there's a lot of uses for this size. I feel like it can go just about anywhere and you can either use it as a table or a plant stand. It was really pretty. I think it definitely needs some work. Like we need to sand it. 20 bucks, like not bad, but it, it needs just a light sanding and um, some cleaning. So that was the first thing I found. These are really pretty brass nesting tables. It could be on the side of a piece of furniture, like the side of a couch, in between some chairs, as a coffee table, things like that. And I thought they were really unique because they're, they are brass, they're solid brass. They're patinaed already, you can see on the kind of legs there. These had so much more detail. Oh, this is turning a lot. So much more detail. So I could put some like brasso on them, clean it up, uh, and then do something to the, for the topper on both. Um, we could do a cut a round piece of marble. We could buy a round piece of marble. Uh, or it could be like a travertine or something natural. Or it could be something, I don't, I'm not really into like glass, just like pure glass. So I feel like it would need to be some kind of stone. And it would be really, really pretty. Like just like snuggled together like that. We ended up getting a deal. 70? 60? 60. 60. 60. For both of them. For both of them. Um, but they're solid, they're they're pretty. I saw this oval painting. Very moody, oval, pretty. Flowers in a vase. I need to clean it up. I love the frame. It was super like pretty. Now he had two. They were a little different sizing. I didn't like its frame as much. It looked more like almost bamboo. And then the vase on the flowers had like an angel face. So I, I liked this one more for my house, but it's equally it's beautiful. I obviously don't need two, so uh, one of them will be for our future pop-up meet-up, meet, meet and greet. Um, but we got a good deal on them and we ended up getting both for 125. Yeah, so they came out to what, 60, 250 a piece? That's, it's a big piece of art. This table does not go here. I just brought it down from upstairs because it, it didn't fit uh, Romeo's TV. It was, we wanted to try and reuse it because we had it in the apartment, but it didn't fit. But I put this here just on the nail that was here. It looked so good. Something about the round here coming down the stairs, the round here, the curve. I don't know, I thought it was really unique. Obviously all the walls in this house are white. <laughs> it's like, everything's white, but that's like really moody. I wish we had like a spotlight um, there that I could light it up, see how dark it, it looks a lot darker on camera, but it would be, see how dark, it's just a, like too dark. I need a light on it. And then once I clean it, it might vibrate up the, the colors a little bit cause it's like really moody. But see, that's what it really looks like. Ooh, it looks kind of scary moody. I'm very into it. It's just hard to see on camera. It looks just like a black hole. This is the other one. It's equally as, as beautiful. It's just, it needs to be in a spot that has like maybe direct sunlight. Cause right now you see the direct sunlight coming on it. So you can see more of the painting right there. It won't get any direct sunlight. So it either needs a spotlight or move it <laughs> somewhere else. There was another booth that had a few big pieces of art that were more rectangular or not. So you don't come across oval art very often. We were very on an oval kick though, weren't we? Yes. We, mom kept picking up oval frames. I was gravitating towards those. I even saw an oval mirror that was really pretty, um, but I didn't, I didn't need a mirror. These were like really unique, but there was one booth that had some larger scale, heavier um, art. Look up this one. We need to pop it back in its frame. 
but I thought it was really pretty. I thought it actually would look good up here, or I could swap the one that I put in the bedroom, which they're similar sizes. I can put the one in the bedroom that I love out here as the first thing you see when you come in the house, and then I can put this one in the bedroom over the dresser. So we can play around with that, but I'm gonna put it up here so we can see what it looks like. I just put it on the nail that was there. <laughs> it's obviously not centered and uh, not high enough, but we can see kind of like what it would look like. It's one of those, it's like very feathered. So it's almost hard in places to concentrate or to focus on it. You see like, you know, it's very feathered here, here, very feathered. It's pretty. Something about it, ha it's, it's gorgeous. I love the house. I love the little lady walking up the drive. I love the trees. Um, the sky is a little more blue than I would like it to be. I tend to like more like that, you know, like warmer kind of tones and see the blue up here is even like more of a green. This is like very blue, but I think it's really beautiful. I need to clean it. I've got, it looks like a piece of paint that's here and just clean the frame. It's a great size for there. It's pretty large. It could either go there or it could go here. So we've got options. This is a big wall too. I think it's really pretty, you know? And then we could see if I wanna swap it with the one in the bedroom or something. Um, just kind of experiment. That's what I like to do. It's like, I like to kind of collect art and then maybe move things around if, if it's gonna work better in another place. Those were like the larger scale art that I found. And then obviously it looked at every boob for little art. Little. <laughs> This one, like, it's nothing special, so to speak, but I like the size of the frame. Um, she's okay, little girl with a little kitty. She's all right. I think I would print one of my mom's pieces or have my mom paint me one. I heard that. <laughs> For this, I could either put it straight up and down, do it sideways, I'd have more versatility in it. This was five bucks. And then I also got this one. I liked the shape because it was like sideways or it could be this way. Also take the mirror out and put a piece of art in it. So I was trying to think of like that, like not necessarily looking for the art itself and the mini frame, but maybe just finding the art or just finding the frame because we can always add art into it um, with a mom as an artist. That would be totally fine with me. I found this very heavy brass ruler. Very unique. I don't even know if it was five bucks. It might've been less than that, but it was just like totally cool. Last thing I got was this little book, little French mom. I'm so sorry. <laughs> we are going to Perry. Mom didn't believe me when I booked the tickets for us later this year. Uh, she was like, oh, what is for, I gave it to her last year for Mother's Day. So come fall, we'll, we'll be going to Paris again. Um, I just I just like the book. I like that it was yellow. Les Jeux Les, les Jeux Sans Fait. Les Jeux Sans Fait. I wouldn't know that, what that means. Les Jeux. When things have reached an irreversible point, you cannot go back now that you have done something. Oh. Oh. The bets have been placed. It's a phrase. The chips are down. Sartre addresses existential themes of liberty, bad faith, destiny, and anguish. What's it about? <laughs> the chips are down. Oh, it's a screenplay. That's what I thought. Like looking at it, the way that it's written and the way that it's like, you know, kind of like laid out, it looks like a screenplay. That is it. That's, you know, I've been very like purposeful with like the things that I've been looking for now that we're in here. We've decorated the house and we're finishing up the guest bedroom with things that um, we already have and a few things I knew we already needed. And I'm just gonna look on, on my adventures. You know, I don't wanna just fill a space quickly. I actually enjoy going to fleas. I enjoy going to estate sales and just finding really, really special things. Did you have fun at the Long Beach, mom? I did. <laughs> Would you want to come back and go again when it's not raining? Or even if it no. Oh, you didn't care? Yeah. Oh, all right. It was nice. It, the weather, like it wasn't cold or hot. It was kind of like just nice. Once I'm in a flea market all day, it's kind of like I can't 
uh, see anymore because I've just been like staring through the sun. That's why I wear a cap or I don't like wearing sunglasses because I like, I can't really see what I'm looking at. So if I don't wear a hat, it's, it becomes like kind of straining on my eyes and I'm like going like that the whole time. So it's like my face starts to hurt or something. It was overcast. It was like perfect. There was less people because most people thought it was going to be raining. I think overall it wasn't, it wasn't that bad. Perfect. Yeah, it was like really nice. Yeah, mom got some frames and beads. Yeah. Art frames and beads. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's what we look for most these days. Frames, art, frames and arts and just like, like small, small pieces. Yeah, it's like, I don't know. I feel like we're always kind of looking for something different. We go through like phases of like what we're looking for. Back here, I'd love to do some like bookshelves. I feel like that would be really pretty like coming into the space, mm -hmm. you know? Um, and of course, stripping these beams up here. Ooh. Not all of them, but like especially the big ones. I don't know, I'd have to see how the paint comes off. That'd be a whole project. But mom's heading back to home tomorrow. Mom needed a vacation. Mom needed to come and yes, she, did. she was very tired. I was tired. <laughs> she was. I'm good now. Yeah. So when I came back to Texas last time, I brought mom a full bag of lemons from our lemon tree. Uh, but I have picked all the ones that I can reach, you know, like with just my hand. So we have this stick. It has a hook on it. It's actually for our skylight uh, shades that we have in the bedroom. So it's the only thing I can think of that we can try and hook some lemons. I got Romeo's shoes on and they're too big for me, but you know, it'll work. Most people pick, a lim pick lemons. We yank well, them. How, how are we supposed to pick them? I don't know. You yank them, I'll catch them. I'm just saying! <laughs> So we are gonna spend the night hanging out. Uh, I have some editing to do and some work to catch up on. Um, and then we'll probably watch a TV show or something. What did we watch last night? Oh, uh, Army of Thieves. Mm -hmm. It was, I, I really liked it. I like thief and heist movies. I think that those are fun. I don't know what she's got. What she got? She stole something. We will see you guys next vlog. Huh? What did she, what do you got? Sweet, <laughs> Oh, I love her. Give it to me. What do you have? Oh, it's a cap. What'd you lose a cap to? Did you lose a cap? I don't know. I'll get it. Bye, guys.